so it's been a while since I did a full walk around with the mods. Uh, basically, the newest thing I've done is put the 35 inch tires on the truck um, and the new suspension uh, that's in here, which is the Eibach Pro Lift. And uh, I got the peak suspension, a one inch spacer up on the front. So it adds about two inches uh, all together. So if anyone's asking, so it's a ZR2 with that kit in order to fit the 35s on there. And I did have to take the front mud flaps off in order to get them to fit. The back ones, I'm just gonna leave for now. They're not hurting anything. Um, but the reason I don't wanna really have to deal with it is because I'm gonna have to draw out uh, that screw right there. Uh, it's like a little tapper. I forget what they're exactly called, but uh, I'm gonna have to drill that out to get it out. And I really don't want to deal with that right now. So, just leave them. They're not hurting anything. As far as the rest of the truck, I haven't really done anything else newer if you watch the rest of the videos. Um, it's mainly just been the suspension and tires that I've been messing with lately. Uh, still got the Tiger light bar. Rewired some of that up. And, uh, Still got the front ditch lights and the Magnus uh, side steps, uh, but otherwise not too much newer. Um, mainly, like I'm saying, mainly I've been concentrating on suspension lately. Um, I'm thinking the next thing I'm gonna save up for is the knee front bumper, um, or I might be saving up to get the snorkel put on. The snorkel goes right here along this pillar um, and the snorkel I've already seen on this peak suspensions truck doesn't impend any blind spot. It'd be like the same blind spot as, uh, that pillar right there. So it's not affecting anything, um, at all. So I'll put the full list of all the mods in the description for everyone. Um, but that's about it. That's the updated what I've done in the past two, three months.